Vera Raghavan, an Indian raw agent, is assigned to capture the terrorist, Amr Farooq in Kashmir. Line mate. One line me khadu jao. Irra, irra, irra. Line boy. Bag is heavy. Hey, who are you? Vira Gava. Senior Field Operative Indian Raw. While he successfully manages to do so, a missile shot by him to prevent Farooq's escape kills a child whom he personally knew. Is the southern perimeter clear? The event dramatist Vera, who quits Raw. Eleven months later, Vera is still reeling from the after effects of the child's death and is suffering from post traumatic stress disorder. He meets Preeti at a wedding, who convinces him to join her security agency Dominic and soldiers headed by Dominic Irud Hayarich. Meanwhile, the Tamil Nadu government receives information about a major terrorist attack planned in Chennai. Along with Preeti and Irad Hayarich, Vera visits the East Coast Mall, which is the last client of their agency where he observes suspicious activities in the mall and deduces that someone else has taken over it. Santa Claus is a little bit of 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 a the terrorists dressed as Santa Claus hijacked the mall. Vera, Preeti, and a few others hide unharmed inside an unopened restaurant. The government led by Vera's ex-associate Altaf Hussain, try to negotiate with the terrorists who demand the release of Farooq. Anyway, the decision is not mine, as I'm simply a tool. I'll convey the information to them. Altaf learns that Vera is also trapped inside the mall and manages to establish contact with him. Hello. Altaf tries to convince Vera to help them. Vera, initially hesitant, is convinced when he realizes that the terrorists are here for Farooq. Please. He kills one of the terrorists, captures another one alive, and brings him to their hideout.
he manages to infiltrate the terrorists and eliminates a few of them. The Home Minister, who is in league with the terrorists, gets them to stage the execution of his wife and daughter Aparna, who are also in the mall, on Life TV. The government yields and agrees to release Farooq. Yes. Veer retaliates and kidnaps Aparna and her mother by pretending to be a Bangladeshi militant to confuse the terrorists and he threatens to kill them if Farooq is released. Umar Farooq veli la vanda, unga ponnu ponda di thaliyu veli la vandu vuru. Yen pecha naane ke kamata. The leader of the terrorists, Amr Saif, senses his impending defeat and seemingly gives up, only to slip among the crowd pretending to be a hostage. Sayyaf soon figures out Vera's real identity and forces him and his aides to give up and captures all of them. With the help of Aparna, Vera manages to escape. So, this is the last warning. Now, you can see the Kadesia. You can see the Kadesia. You can see the Kadesia. Red box. Red box. Red box. Papu. And execute Sayyaf and the terrorist while making sure the hostages escape to safety. One. Boom. <laughs> The Home Minister is arrested for his involvement with the terrorists. Meanwhile, amidst all the negotiation, Farooq was released. A month later, Vera finds and captures him in Pak and after surviving a long air chase against the Pakistan Air Force manages to bring him back to India to have him arrested. Five. Well done. In a mid-credits scene, Veera, Preethi, and the rest of his crew celebrate their escapades in Goa.